10, nine of the 12 candidates fighting to be Birmingham's mayor made their case to voters at a forum moderated by CBS 42 morning news anchor Art Franklin. CBS 42 news reporter Michael Clark joins us live now. He's been talking to a lot of the people at that forum about the biggest issues in their neighborhoods. Michael? Yeah, sure. I talked to people living across various parts of Birmingham, but no matter where they live, the rhetoric as far as what's important to them in this election remains the same. It's prioritizing education to bring in more growth and more jobs to the city and reducing crime all among the topics today. Nine people, one stage, but to dozens of audience members, the candidates are for now just names. I, I want to listen to the candidates as a whole. Uh, to hear one person always say what they will do. I want to see them all together. The issues most important to voters, also the most frequently debated, dealing with violent crime, supporting education, and bringing new jobs and growth to the city beyond just downtown. Birmingham is more than just the South Side. I mean, the, the, the main veins that run into the South Side is more my concern. The outer cities, uh, Inslee. West End. Several candidates talked about the importance of small businesses. Al Elliott is on the cusp of opening one, and he's here to listen to ideas that might impact his decision on where to set up shop. Depending on the, the direction of the city, there are several neighboring cities, right, that can attract similar businesses that I'm trying to open, but I really want to open it in Birmingham. While it's mostly the city school board directly controlling education, voters made it clear they want the mayor doing whatever he or she can to support the youth of Birmingham's future. We have one on the way, and if we wanted to stay in the city of Birmingham, it'd be nice to know that the schools are taken care of and looked after, and that education is really important to um, the politicians. Now, tomorrow is the deadline to register to vote for the August 22nd election. For more on the candidates or the issues, just download our CBS 42 News app. For now, reporting live in downtown Birmingham, Michael Clark, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on. Michael, thank you. CBS 42 streamed much of the forum on CBS 42 Facebook. You can hear from all of the candidates there. Many people commented about what they heard, and if you want to have your say, go to our Facebook page, click video on the left-hand side, and you'll find it.